LJ Scott again. Second and goal from just inside the five. Peppers on a straight keeper. Turns the corner at the pylon. A Michigan touchdown. And they're a point after away from the equalizer. Gerald Holmes moves the pile. And now an interesting decision for Mark D'Antonio. Gerald Holmes spins. Is he still alive? It looks like he might be short. That second effort almost got him to the line to game. But it looks like Michigan got the stop. Jabril Peppers came up and just seemed to hold Gerald Holmes short. And why Don Brown loves him. It's not being run at. It's when you run away, that speed comes to life and Peppers makes the play. Peppers, plenty of room for a return from his own 44. That's across the 50 into Michigan State territory. Jabril Peppers, though, in to take the direct snap. A little zone read. He's got room. Jabril Peppers spins inside the 35-yard line with a Michigan first down. Back to Shane Morris, a quarterback, though. Jet sweep to Jabril Peppers. Out of bounds. L.J. Scott lost another yard. Jabril Peppers one-on-one -on -one in the open field. Such tremendous speed. You know, a season ago, it was the other side. It was Chesson that was their offensive MVP. Darbo just keeps getting better and better. Well, speaking of difference makers, here's one now. Look at the spin move by Jabril Peppers. One player of the state of Illinois, big-time recruit, and he's going to be a good one. In a couple years, he's not going to miss that tackle, but right now he's a 6'6", 260-pound DN that's saying, Man, there was no one in high school like that. There is nobody that got out of my claws and out of my reach. That's man-to-man -man coverage. You know what you're going to get. Blitz coming. Lewerke in trouble. Down he goes. Jabril Peppers gets the sack. And Michigan gets another stop on downs. And they put this game on ice. As O'Connor will run the option and pitches it backwards and it's scooped up and there goes Jabril Peppers. He's going to score going the other way. And pad the Michigan lead. Here today I was prepared to talk about Peppers getting run at and run on and, and ducking under blocks and going over the top of blocks and doing those things. After 60 minutes, Bob, you know, I'm, I'm convinced. I'm convinced if there's a defensive guy in college football that's worthy to get to New York City, You're not Lamar Jackson, it's not Sean Watson if he takes care of business, or Jake Browning at Utah. But what this kid does in every phase of the game, all three of them, and the impact he can have and the love for football that you see, you know, be it with the slip at the end, he's special talent. Running option, you can see O'Connor, he can't even chase it down. And Michigan State's going to have real questions about their quarterback next week. Two of them knocked out of this game already. O'Connor is just limping and hobbling through. And Peppers to the finish line. I think Michigan is. It'll be a wild ride to the finish line. Wilton Spate makes it official. The backflip from Peppers. And it's a Michigan win in their rivalry game with the Spartans. 32-23 for Alex.